Hello, my brilliant reschool buddies. You made it to part two. This video is brought to you by your learning friends, reschool and Yamema. And together with our friends, you are going to learn to count to 100. Let's jump straight in. Last time, we learned all about how to count to 50 on our chart. You still remember how this chart works, don't you? We start with our T number, and then we drag our marker down. Let's do it with 51. Take the 50 over, and then we bring the one marker down, 51. Let's do the same with 52, take the 50, bring the 2, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59 and 60 down underneath. 50. Let's carry on. 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, and 70. 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, and 80. 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, and 90. 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, and the big 100. You did it. You made it to 100. Was that difficult? It was easy peasy, just like English. So, now you have the chart and you can count to 100. Let's have a few questions to make sure you've got this. Let's see what you know. Can you tell me how to write this number in words? Is it 79, 97, 970, or 79. That's it. It's 79. The hyphen brings the two numbers together. So don't forget your hyphen. Can you tell me how to write this number? Is it 40? 41 or 14. Yes, 
That's right, it is 14. Remember to clearly say the teen with the N. Let's do one more number. How would you write this number? Would you write 30, 35, 530 or 35? That's right, it's 35. Don't forget that hyphen. Do you get it? And we already used this in our lesson about telling time. Do you remember? Let's quickly do a few questions to remind you how we use it when we are talking about time. Let's have a look. Can you tell me what time is it? Is it 745, 7045, 457 or just 7? That's right, it's 745. Let's keep this clock here for a moment. How else can I say this time? Can you say 15 minutes past 7? 57? Quarter to 8? Or almost 8? That's right. You can also say quarter to eight. We have been looking closely at the time lesson because our next lesson is all about tenses and tenses are all about time and when it happened. Have another look at your time. If you are not 100% sure, then come along with me to the next lesson. I'll see you there.